what is up frostings we're about with another video and right here i got wales rpg adventure um i think this is probably like one of the best rpg mods i've seen oh, i just jumped right into it and it tells you this little story right here i'm gonna just let y'all read it because the dude that's reading it isn't even reading it it's just like a weird voice but nah, I think this is probably like one of the coolest RPG mod packs out right now. More than likely. Look, I'm gonna let y'all do that on y'all's time because I've already seen this story a lot. Alright, so you can choose a woman, a man, you can like choose who to be. Uh, you got a pet as well. Allie is great. A great mining companion. Give him a block and he'll help you collect the item he's holding. Uh, which I think is pretty good. I don't know why the voice is still going in the background. Uh, you got a bat, that's a pet. You got a chicken, that's a pet. You got some type of wisp, pretty much. Um, you got a fox. You got a frog. You got an octolot. You got a bunny. You got pig you got a horse and then uh yeah which i think is probably the best one to pick then you got a tutorial right here um you can use your scroll for like certain things i'm gonna get to all that anyway so this is pretty much a tutorial as well um that's all in a different language because the guy that made this is in a different language but it's in english too um i'll let y'all look at that y'all so I started this on my mobile device because I just wanted to check like what it would be. Um, I did I did break some stuff because I was just like testing it out. So there's there's things you can't break in creative and uh, fly past. My alley still follow me. I'm just making sure. All right, so this is it, it'll it'll give you. All right, let me let me let me say. All right, so when you start. When you start it, you'll go through all that, that stuff that I just went through. Alright, then you'll take your parchment, and you can see it tells you lumberjack, zero, miner, zero, uh, excavation, zero, agriculture, zero. So you would press down on it. Then it opens up this menu right here. You got acquired gems, um, you got missions, you got beastery. You got status, you got credits, you got tutorial and teleport. I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all the credits. Uh, this is made by Will Force. The menu is made by Sprinter Max. Um, let, me, let me go to Beast area because that's pretty cool. So right here, when you get introduced to like a new mob or something, it'll pretty much pop that mob up into this book. But I think you have to kill it first. So the teleport. You have to unlock all these teleports. Like you can't just teleport to them. Like this one, it's unlocked because it's like the first mission that you even get. So it's gonna be unlocked automatically. Um, let's go to status. To armor, we got chainmail, ten spiders, gold, ten witches. So pretty much you have to defeat these mini mobs and these type of mobs to use that armor tools. Alright, so you'd have to get XP, blah blah blah, and then bam, you can use those items. Let's see mission. Alright, so this is the first mission. I'm gonna just show y'all the first mission. You got you got tips as well. Alright, the best and easiest way to collect the sword. So pretty much it just wants me to collect a wooden sword also there's mobs that you can go kill that's got level two and level three blah 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 so this guy right here you would go interact with him and it would load up the survival now we go talk to him all right so he says my name is Silf Silfo um, I am charge of forwarding you to your destination all right so you give him the wooden sword Done. Mission complete. All right. So now, when you go back into your parchment, and you go to see mission, it'll say mission two. Now he wants you to bring him armor, so you can show him that you know how to make armor. All right. So you put that armor on, and then you show him the armor. 
And you see it says, I uh, started a new journey, blah, blah, blah. Mission. So they need you to kill, you need to go kill creepers and get gunpowder pretty much. I, I had to come here, now that I got the gunpowder, then I would interact with this dude. Alright, so, it, it also has custom music on here, and the custom little noises. Alright, so bam, gave him his stuff. Alright, so, I'm just gonna let y'all know now, before you go put this heart in the tree, Make sure you um go level up because there's a boss fight to this. Like you, you you're gonna wanna level up. Yeah, it's because I already did it on a different account. All right, so whatever. Just know that the heart goes the heart goes right there. All right, so this is a solo a solo mod pack. All right, so you drop down here after it tells you someone left messages in here. You can still play it. Pretty sure the boss would spawn down here. Yeah, the boss would spawn down here. Let me see if I can find him. He's gotta finish the missions for him to spawn. And I didn't finish the mission right. Um, I guess I can show y'all some of the bosses though. Alright, this is a trader that you can trade with. That'll probably come into the game later on or something. Uh, I think this is one of the bosses. Then this is another boss. Some of these bosses are from a different mod as well though. They're not from the same mod. Um, yeah, other than that though, y'all um, stay frosty, hit the like button, subscribe, comment, and yeah, peace.